Welcome back to McPhee Ford. Today we're taking a look at this brand new 2023 Ford Bronco. And this particular Bronco here is a wild track model. It's finished in Area 51, which is actually a new color for last year, so it's relatively new. And the wild track is the highest trim level available for the Bronco without going to that kind of full-fledged Raptor model. So this is a very, very off-road capable vehicle. It's also equipped with the Lux package, so it's very well equipped as well. And you got lots of options and features, and we're going to go through all of those today in this video. And we'll start here with the front end of the Bronco, where the Wild Track has a uh, exclusive grille. You have the gloss black finish there, Bronco logo spelled out, and it actually houses the front view camera system in between the O and the N. Have the LED signature headlights. And this one has the optional modular uh, Ford Performance steel bumper. So this is a modular bumper. Uh, there are pieces and you know different parts that actually are removable. And is a steel bumper, of course. So it's fully, I know, protected. Got your skid plates down there, and you have the exposed tow hooks in front. There's a Wild Track graphic on the hood. And standard with the Wild Track is the Sasquatch package. Now the Sasquatch package is actually available to other trim levels as an option, but on the Wild Track it comes standard. And the big thing that you get with that is the wheel and tire. So this is a 35 inch tall tire, massive, massive tire, and it sits on a 17 inch beadlock capable gloss black wheel. Really, really nice wheel there. Uh, the tire measures out to an LT31570. Uh, again, on that 17-inch wheel, so it roughly measures out to a 35. And it's a Goodyear Territory Mud Terrain tire. It sits on the Fox suspension. And you also have the wider fender flares to accommodate those larger tires. Got your Wild Track logo there on the side. Camera under the mirror. And this is a four-door model, of course. You get your four-door with the hard top. And then we come around to the back end, got the LED signature taillights, as well as the rear parking sensors that do run along the bottom of the bumper there. And then you can see, have a full size spare tire mounted to the back of the swing gate here. Uh, again, full size spare, really, really nice. Got your rear view camera, which is actually integrated in the center of the wheel there, super cool. Got your Bronco logo off to the side, which is finished in gloss black. And now if we take a look into the interior of this Bronco, this particular one here has the uh, optional leather seat. Uh, so you can actually get leather trim seats here. Uh, standard, you actually get like a vinyl and cloth, but this one it has your leather. It also includes the power adjustments as well. So they are fully power operated. They're heated, really nice, really comfortable. Got your Bronco logo on the back, sandstone and black color. And then on the door panel, got some more sandstone uh, on, the, on the vinyl on the door here. Got your locks, automatic headlight controls, as well as the electronic parking brake. And we'll step inside. Let's take a look at the key fob here. So this is a keyless fob. It includes the uh, remote start system. And push button start. And the wild track comes standard with the 2.7 liter twin turbo EcoBoost engine which makes 315 horsepower. And this is actually one of uh, two engines available for your standard Bronco model. There's also a 2.3 liter EcoBoost, which is actually a four cylinder, and that can be mated to a seven speed manual transmission. But the 2.7 liter like we have here is only available with the 10 speed automatic. Uh, this 10 speed is really, really nice for off-roading. It's got a super aggressive first gear, so you get lots of torque, lots of control. Really, really nice there. And again, of course, these are all four wheel drive, but we'll move on to this nice leather wrapped heated steering wheel. As I briefly mentioned at the beginning, this one is equipped with the Lux package. So your Lux package is uh, one of a couple of different equipment groups, uh, you know, that you can get on these uh, on these Bronco models, and it includes a lot of different features. Um, like here in the steering wheel, we've, we've got adaptive cruise control, so that's included with the Lux package. You've also got a couple other things like the heated steering wheel and and your wireless charger. That's all included with the Lux package. So there's a couple of different things. It's all kind of bundled together in that there. So um, again, you get your adaptive cruise right there, you got lane centering, you got controls on the right side for the center gauge cluster screen right there. Uh, really nice screen, got a lot of different information that you can use off-road as well. 
And then in the middle, you're gonna find the 12 inch SYNC 4 display. And uh, this is a really, really nice screen. It's really high resolution, great. Uh, you know, it integrates really well with the Bronco as well. You got your uh, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. You also have the uh, built-in navigation system. You got Sirius XM, Bluetooth, of course, fully, fully connected. All your various, you know, key features like the zone lighting, get your towing section in there, driver assistance features, really, really nice. And then on top of the screen, these are what Ford calls the hero switches. Now this is basically some of your off-road switch gear that you can use. Um, so first thing, you got a front locking differential and a rear locking differential. So you can basically engage all those and all four tires will turn at the exact same time. Uh, providing maximum traction and then beside that you got your trail turn assist and that is only available with the automatic transmission like we have here so got your trail turn traction control and then of course your hazard light switch right over there now there is one open spot here that's actually for the front sway bar disconnect which is available on a couple of other different models uh, trim levels like the badlands and the raptor models um, so the, you are missing that with the wild track but definitely uh no not not required because Lots of traction with those tires, you know, those massive 35 inch tires. Uh, but down here, you got your climate control. Uh, again, very easy to use. Uh, we've got the readouts back on these knobs here for 2023 on most of these, uh, most of these Bronco models. Got your heated seats, heated steering wheel, and then again, that wireless charger down there. So you have wireless charger and you have wireless uh, CarPlay. So you can, you, know, you don't even need cables at all, which is definitely nice. And then right down here, got your four wheel drive settings. And this also includes 4A, so you see a two-speed transfer case. Got your GOAT mode, so you can actually cycle through various different drive modes via the gauge cluster screen. Change up all the modes for you. And then you got your you know, window switches and your mirrors right there. Lockable console, which is also finished in vinyl. Ford, of course, thought of this as, you know, it's meant to be cleaned out and easily. Uh, you can actually hose down the doors and you can hose down the interior and not have to worry about anything getting muddy or dirty or wet because uh, it'll all be you know it's made specifically for that um, also with the lux package you get the bang and olsen sound system so you have lots of speakers you know around uh, you get the subwoofer in the trunk really really nice sound system you also have a glove box right there lots of space and being a hard top model you have the uh, switches up top for the removal of the hard top so you have a series of you know switches and levers that you got to do to uh, unhook it but it does come off but now if we take a look into the rear seat again this is the four-door model so of course you're going to get a lot more space back here you know comparing to the two-door model and another thing you actually get is the addition of a center seat uh, the two doors only come with uh, two seats in the back whereas your four-door comes with three so if you happen to carry five people often definitely got to go with a four-door and uh, just in general, if you carry you know, more than two people at once, four door is probably the better option. And it's definitely the most popular by a long shot for the Bronco models. Um, but moving on to the seats, again, they're very similar to the front. You got the sandstone and black leather, again, because this one is optioned with the uh, leather interior. Really nice, you got your center console right there. It just features some cup holders. And on the back, you got a 400 watt inverter outlet. You also have USB, so you can keep everything charged up, window switches. And then again, the controls or the switches for the hardtop removal are right up there. We'll come around to the trunk area, open up the side swing gate. It's got a nice heavily assisted strut, so it does open up pretty easily. And then with the hardtop pretty easily, we just flip that open just like that. So back here again, four-door model doesn't uh, you know, give you a lot more space in both the rear seat area and also the trunk, especially the trunk. You get a lot more space back here. So if you happen to carry luggage around or whatnot, definitely go with the four-door. Uh, but the rear seats do fold down as well. So you can carry, you know, you can put the seats down and have longer items back here. Got a subwoofer in the back, again, for that Bang & Olufsen sound system. 12-volt connector, you got lights back here. And there's actually speakers right up here if you happen to take the top off as well. And there's lots of different you know, hooks and tie down points. We've got carpeted floor mats. We've got the storage bags for the front row uh, roof panel. And there's also some additional storage underneath with the spare tire changing kit as well. So if you're interested in a 2023 Bronco just like this one, you can give us a call or you can visit our website at mcfeeford.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.